Hello, this is Morgan. Tonight I'm going to be showing you how to make crock pot barbecue chicken. It's my first time making it. It is a Weight Watchers recipe. It is one point for two thirds of a cup, um, which is great if you ask me. So I'll show you how to make it. All right, so first you're gonna to wanna to season your chicken. You need two pounds of chicken. So I measured it with my scale. Love my scale, got it from Amazon. So I already did the minced onion. So I'll do the garlic powder and then my Himalayan pink salt. Okay, now that I got my chicken I put minced onion garlic powder and the Himalayan pink salt on them just just a little bit you don't need too much so now I'm going to put them into the crock pot and you're going to cook these on high for what on that one yet, for three and a half to four hours so nothing crazy all right so now that those are in there just place them in there so now it tells you into a bowl, you want to put one cup of the G. Hughes sugar-free barbecue sauce, and then you're going to do one tablespoon of the brown sugar. So we'll go ahead and do the brown sugar. And they say you want to make sure it is stirred very smooth and no chunks. All right, and you're going to want one cup of the barbecue sauce. It's quite a bit, but it's sugar-free, so zero points. And you're just gonna pour it in there. And then I'm just gonna use a whisk to mix it. I think that will be the best. Okay, now that I mix the barbecue sauce and the brown sugar together, I'm gonna pour it over my chicken. All right, now it says to use half a can of the Coke Zero vanilla, but I couldn't find the Zero, so I just got the Coke um, vanilla Coke. So it says use half a can, so I'm just gonna measure out. There's 12 ounces in a can, so I'll just use six ounces then. So of course I'll get on my scale with my little cup. And I wanna switch it, show ya. So I put my cup on, so I had to hit that. Maybe. I just want six ounces. Oop, I need to change the ounces. So I just want six ounces. Calculates pretty quick, so you gotta watch. Perfect, six ounces. So then you wanna just kinda put it in here. And that's it. So you just put it on high for three and a half hours. After the chicken is all done, it goes for three and a half hours. You will shred it. And when I shred chicken, I use a like a um, mixer, and I just go through the bowl, and it shreds it like perfect. I will show you guys after after I come back. Okay, now that it cooked for four hours. I got it in my bowl and I'm going to shred it with my mixer. Super simple, super easy. <laughs> okay, now that is done, my fork. Look how nice and shredded that is. So nice. So now we're gonna put it back into the barbecue sauce. We're just gonna 
mix it all together now. This looks so freaking good. And it smells so amazing. I'm probably going to put more chicken in, but you cook and you learn. Gotta try it. Let's see. Wow. That is really good. So now I'm going to pair it with some mac and cheese, and I'll show you which mac and cheese I use and some corn. This is the mac and cheese I use. It's the Lean Cuisine. So good. It's one of my favorites. So easy to compare it with anything. The whole package is eight points, but I always cut it in half and serve like half on the plate and it's only four points. So my whole meal tonight will be five points because my chicken will be two thirds cup, which is one point and then Half of this will be four points. Here is the final product. Five point dinner, corn zero because it's corn, zero points. I put a little bit of spray butter on it with some salt and some pepper. So yeah, hope you enjoyed my video. It's delicious. I will make this a lot. It's quick, easy, so good. So like my page, subscribe, comment, share it. Thank you and have a great day.